What's up everybody? Brian Clark here to bring you a spooktacular update in this month's release of Visual Studio Code. <laughs> Let's go check out the highlights of it. File and folder icon themes are excellent in helping to quickly identify their types at a glance. Now this can be done directly in IntelliSense too. Begin typing an import statement and you'll be prompted with potential options along with icons for their types. Have you ever needed to find a specific section of code that you can't seem to pinpoint? Try out the multi-line search with regular expression support to nail down that pesky code. In addition, you can enable the show line numbers setting, which will show the line numbers for search results. If your project contains multiple applications, such as when you're using multi-root workspaces, you'll want to debug the separate apps at the same time. You can use the debugger to kick them off and now see the output of each in separate debug consoles. This should help in discerning the results between your running applications more easily. Last month you saw a highlight around the UI for Windows, and this month you get one for Mac. For those running macOS Mojave, and in particular the dark mode, VS Code supports showing all native UI elements should you have this mode enabled. Go ahead and check it out. You may know you can find all references of a function or variable, but did you know you can also list all references too? What's great about this feature is you get a nice new view that displays references in a way that's easy to sort through. Right click the function or variable you're looking to check and select list all references to try it out yourself. Debugging can be a pain and having the right tools for the job is imperative. VS Code has published new recipes which are guides to help you get started debugging for various scenarios. These recipes vary from different languages to specific frameworks and more. Find the one that fits your project and start squashing those bugs. That does it for this month's release of Visual Studio Code. Thank you so much. I got to get out of here quick before something else happens. So hope you enjoyed it. Share it with whoever you can, and I'll see you next time. Happy coding, everyone.